my channel. It's officially, I actually don't know the date. It's June 12th and it's 8.20. So I have to get breakfast really early, but this is our second week of classes and I can't wait to see you guys. So much for us, being allowing us to see whether that's I'm spending the afternoon just walking around the city of Riva. I haven't really seen a lot of it, so I decided today would be a great day since we have a free afternoon just to explore some more. And it's been so pretty out here. I'm gonna keep showing you all around. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> really yeah, I'll admire her from afar. My bell towers. Chiasco. It's a fiasco. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys, we made it to Milan. We're doing a day trip for literally two hours. But you know, that's what's fun about studying abroad. Is it an apple? Yeah, there's an apple out here. I've been to Milan already because that's where Whoa. my plane was, but they haven't been. Woo. So it's their first time, and I'm going to attempt to show them around Milan. Just for this. I want one of these things. Welcome to Italy. <laughs> the exact location where my will broke off my suitcase.
don't know who he is, but he's a man in uniform. And there's so many people over here. Hey guys, this is Future Jackie uh, coming to you. Um, so there's a lot of people because the former prime minister had died that day. Just thought you guys should know. Okay. It's the third largest Virginia Tech alumni chapter. That side. Of guys, it's our last day in Riva. We have class. I just finished breakfast. I'm wearing my tech shirt because we're gonna meet students from the University of Texas. I think. We're about to go meet them right now. Restoring the coast. Right. She goes. Flying dragons. <laughs> Dying for my lover. <laughs> then I arrive again because I'm the queen. <laughs> Guys, we got me hiking again. I'm so tired of hiking. Go hokies. <laughs> and I'm so tired, but it's okay. We're going to make it. We are. Yeah. Ever so slowly. I'm tired of these activities. We made it to the second castle and I did not die. I did. I felt like I was going to. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Oh. <laughs> Can I do it again? Sure. Hi guys, my name is Desiree. Thank you so much for subscribing to my video. Jacqueline is old news. This is now a new station all about me Anyways. and my experiences in Milan, Spain, Madrid, Geneva. <laughs> and she probably went to Germany and didn't tell me. I did not go to Germany, but okay. So Spice Hotel. Yeah, we finished our project. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Ready to run. Is this ours? This is us. Wow, this is crazy. We are back in Como. What a beautiful place. Such a tiny car. Volta, one of the first, first electric battery. Yeah. He made the battery? Oh, he invented the battery. Oh, thank you, dude. <laughs> it happens. So after this, we're going to try the. Yeah. When your food comes in, Charlie, would you want to give me a photo of yours and hers? I can't, I can't get over the bottles. So. Nom nom.
Let's play ball. <laughs> Como Duomo. I actually don't know what it's actually called, but that's what my teacher's been calling it. So I'm gonna stick with that. It kind of looks like it. We're going to the Silk Factory, and I should not have worn jeans because it's a little hot. Pile highways and byways to get to this museum of silk. Oh. We did it! Yay! This was a hike, and I'm in jeans. I'm hot. We made it to the Silk Museum after a long run. We didn't yeah. really run. Shh. We ran. Exactly. I'm gonna think DC stands for Death of Christ because I don't know. What? Like the entrance. Silk factory. These make silk. So worms. <laughs> he doesn't like your pasta. Oh, my pasta. It was so yummy though. Trigger warning. So worms. Um, has anyone checked train card? We met the worms who build our clothes. They make. <laughs> I was trying to make the sound they make. It wasn't really working. I'll just bleep what I did. Jason, make the sound. <laughs> <laughs> She's hard at work making some silk. Well, if we take the 1810. Ooh, this looks cool. This is a fit club we would wear. The Lord's Supper. But silk. I actually got to see it in Italy. It's gonna be a trip if we weren't running around. We have to go back for our closing program. The Bye Silk Museum. I'm gonna cry, I'm gonna cry this too. This is that medieval tower too. The founding of the city. Oh! Whoa. Medieval tower. We missed the train. But we got a free bus ride. There's a train coming out next. The stupid bus was driving fast and the freaking furious the entire time. And then the stoplight, just, we just kept hitting all of them. But now we're going back to home for the last time I can say that. No. <laughs> I'm so depressed. I think actually. Bye, Como, for the last time. <laughs> Dang it, I didn't get your arms in it. Yeah, Grayson. <laughs> the train's here. Lucarno going to Como. Last ride back to Riva. This is so bittersweet. <laughs> this is our last train ride together. Anyways, he said four people could. Oh, hey. He says four people could fit together. So Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> no, do I look okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Have the toga party on. Yes. Salud. 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 <laughs> Maybe give a heart to another person and we go around and until everybody else has another person's heart. Aww. So I really sweet. I didn't get it right. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't literally get it right. Thank you. Thank you. Sage. And the reason why I choose Sage is because, one, I feel like our friendship got a lot closer. Like, we knew Haley back in last yeah. semester, but I think this trip overall, I got to know more of your outgoingness, more of your personality, ways that you show kindness to other people, ways that you check in, ways that you make your voice heard. 
I don't have enough hearts because I would give all of you one. Amen. Um, Except Colt. It was. <laughs> <laughs> She's not bad about her. She's not bad. <laughs> Things were, were easier when we had a program that was regular. First two weeks of every first summer session. First two weeks of every first summer session. Uh, and with it being four years since we had done this, and of course, Labor Day weekend, I got COVID. And then that week, I got an email from Rachel Fitzgerald, and she said, you do know that uh, the Steger Center's booked up for the summer. I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> no, no, no. I, I should have gotten in touch with you earlier. So <clears throat> my heart sank, and we were doing a lot of scrambling throughout the rest of the semester. And you all know, we started out at Franklin, and then we got to move here, and there have been hiccups along the way. And mm -hmm. uh, there always are. You know, things come up. But you all have been very patient. And this is what you all have done the last two weeks is hard. I mean, it really is. If there's any times that it seemed hard, it's because it is. So thank you all for your patience, and I hope it lived up to the hype. I hope it's been transformative and unforgettable. So there's the Hokies. Even though Here. Let's go. Hokies. 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 Okay, fine. I'll try. Yes. Yes. She's my boyfriend. That's sweet. He's, uh, he's me and Alyssa. We're packing up to get ready to go. It's so sad. I'm gonna cry, but it's 9.51 on June 16th. So we're some of the last people. My train doesn't leave till like one to get to Milan. But yeah, packing. Last look at the Steger Center. <laughs> Still crying. The last of Lotto in Switzerland. Milano Centrale. Our last train ride there. Our last train ride in Switzerland. It's been fun. Do y'all see how small the elevator is? I'm literally in a box. I need Europe to get with the program and bigger elevators. We made it in Milan and we're gonna ride some scooters. <laughs> we're gonna go to the castles and then eat our sandwiches that uh, Jared, Buddy, and the chefs made. And we're gonna go to the castle and eat them. I'm excited. It's 25 cents per minute to ride this. So hopefully it doesn't take too long. <laughs> Castle. Lunch at the castle. I bet they did some jousting in here. show you how many stairs you have left, which I think is just so nice. You wanna go down it? Hello. And the church is crazy. In the church. <laughs> oh God, wow. I lived. To climb any more stairs, I better meet Jesus. I need there to be a Jesus meet and greet. So beautiful, though. 
we read online that we weren't supposed to wear tank tops so i'm wearing like a dress with a sweater because they said no shorts no like exposed skin and now we're no one else is wearing this stuff we're the only people dressed up and it's so hot like it's 80 degrees uh, burning up so much <laughs> so now we're sitting on the roof of a church because we're dying of sweat <laughs> this is cool we're on top of a cathedral yeah. this is that up there is so beautiful Me too, girl. Me too. Wow. Wow. What a, what a, what a, wow. I love these types of stairs. I get a house, I want furniture that feels like this. It's so You sweet. want marble? Yeah, I like the way it feels like sleek. That's very true. Mark, build me my house like this, please. Oh. <laughs> We're inside the, whoa. This is beautiful. Wow. Oh, I can't get all the way up there, but that's so pretty. The sky detailing that is insane. So many babies. <laughs> so many babies. Lady Liberty. That's a mood. <laughs> I don't know what he's doing, but I'm trying to be like him. Just laying down. <laughs> I think that's Mary up there. It looks, I assume, it has to be Mary. Oh, it's foggy. Okay. McDonald's Nutella muffin I'll see the McFlurry option It's crazy Snickers McFlurry That looks delicious Smarties I don't know how I feel about that The stash looks cool Don't worry Presentation's A1 Look at this nice tray <laughs> This is what a McDonald's looks like This is crazy Hey guys I'm in Italy and I'm going to show you guys the McDonald's. I just got like a regular fry, Coke Zero, and then they have this thing called a Mediterranean chicken. It looks like this. But also, like, yeah, and it gives you five hours to get to Woodbridge. So, there until 4 to 4 30, something. Hi, y'all. So, we got some nuggets looking mighty fine. We have a uh, pesto rosso, which also looks mighty fine. Ooh, all that sauce on one side. Interesting. <laughs> and a good old Coke. Uh, yeah, we're gonna try this first. See how it is. And, yeah. Tastes like something my mom makes. Oh. Mm -hmm. Solid. Very solid. I'm gonna try a chicken nugget. This is what it looks like. Wow. Hey, it's crisp. A little dry, but crisp. That's some real meat right there. Okay, so the last thing I need to try, it's a Nutella muffin. It looks so good. It looks like cornbread, I'm not gonna lie. Wow. 
know. That is sweet. I haven't even gotten the Nutella part yet. That? That is so good. That is heavenly. That might be my favorite thing I've eaten here at McDonald's so far. If I have to rank it, it's Italian McDonald's, Switzerland McDonald's, American McDonald's. That is my rating. How about... I have the same rating. Same rating, it's same. Like, this is so crisp, but getting full, just like not even halfway through. And yeah. I feel like, you know what, we're, we're going to seek out for the best restaurant, for the best McDonald's. <laughs> I'm like, did it, if I'm going to finish my fries, I'm going to get a small fry. And I'm like, I'm not starving, like, I'm so full. That never happens at McDonald's in America, but I'm like, full, full. I have like half fries, a sub of muffin. My children, if it is this, sure, it feels good. I'm like, stuck. So true, bestie. So true. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this edition of McDonald's until I go to another country. Something's happening. Every time I come to Milan, something's always going on. <laughs> <ride> ben arrivati, voi no, giustamente. <ride> Grazie. Ferrari che si preparano a sfilare su questo palco. Ben arrivati, welcome. Beautiful inside this car, wow. Queste Ferrari dovreste vederle, thank you, you can go because they are pushing us. <laughs> It's such a big candy store. They have M&M hot chocolate. Interesting. They have quite a large selection of pink pops up here. This is how they think we eat in America. I only have ever had any of these cereals in my life. Reese's Puff Duke. I've never eaten Oreo Cheerios. This is beautiful. What a beautiful sun set. My last European sunset. Well, I guess well, in Spain. We'll get a European sunset tomorrow. You might not. Yeah. No. Oh. Rip her up. This car is a need. It's yellow. time for me it's probably sitting on the public stairs also for me this man is it's moving ever so slowly this is actually kind of terrifying do you see how slow we're moving? Okay. Why are we moving so slow? We're on the way home. First stop, airport, and going to Madrid. But Europe, please stop with these small elevators. Only I can barely fit in here with these bags. Okay, let's go. We made it to the airport. We passed this the first time we came here. We're back. And I'm gonna cry again. I know, it's like a full circle moment. <laughs> hey y'all, so for some reason, I don't ever cry this channel. I think this is my first time crying. But I've been here in Mount Pinsa Airport since um, like 11. It's currently 1.23. I had called like the travel agency I booked through. I called the airline like three, five times. And I could not get on the plane with Charlie. So I'm stuck here until 7 o'clock at night because I cannot board my plane till 4 30. we don't leave till 7 30. I, I like i try to check in everything so i'm sitting in the corner on the floor of all pizza and nobody can seem to help me so this is my update on yet another thing uh me trying to get somewhere and it's just not working out 
I don't think I meant to uh, fly at all. So, yay, airport. Screw you, Mal Pitch the airport though. I'm tired of you. Your workers rude. Hey y'all, I look tired. That's because I am, and I cried my eyes out for like two hours. But it's um, let's see what time it is. It's 5:08. I am now waiting for my plane that doesn't board till six. Oh y'all already knew that. I'm still waiting for my plane. It doesn't board till like 6:28, and then we don't leave till like 7:30. So I don't have a gate number, but I am literally starving, like so hungry. So I ordered pizza, the same like pizza I've had like for the past three days. I wanted pasta, but they didn't have any. So I probably won't be able to eat any other time until tomorrow morning because by the time I land, it'll be like 9.30 at night. But Charlie has landed in Madrid and hopefully he's having fun um, without me while well, I'm stuck at the airport still. But yeah, um, I've been reading this book called Hook, Line, and Seeker. It's really good. It's been keeping me entertained. And then I'm gonna eat, so hopefully it gets more exciting. Pretty cool airport. Okay, estamos trabajandos. We are working. Oh. Made it to the hotel in Spain. We are in Madrid. I have not seen a single thing. And I probably will not see a single thing because it's 10 o'clock at night. But we're here. And we have to leave here by 8.30 in the morning. Let me go find Charlie. Hey guys, it is currently 7.30 on Sunday, the 18th, happy Father's Day. Got my bag, heading downstairs to eat my last European meal probably, which kind of sucks, but let's go. I think they even showed the food I ate, but that was bussin'. Charlie is the one I shoved that down. Oh, good. If you ever need to stay in Madrid, stay here. Great hotel, great food. And they even have a free shuttle to make you to the hotel. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Yeah. To number S. I mean, letter S, Lord. Oh. The real Madrid. This is such a huge airport. To gate 46. <laughs> America. I'm so tired of having to go through all these borders though. More border control. Yay. What did they do to my bag? They strip searched my bag and broke the zipper. <sighs> America first, second to none, and we own the finish line. 